Legend and folks, my name is Plasma. Welcome to my top three reasons should you consider watching Angel Beats PA Works. Angel Beats produced by Aniplex and PA Works, of course, from the creators of Air, Canon, Clanad, and countless other animes. And basically, PA Works is known for making drama, sad type animes. And Angel Beats is definitely a sad anime, but in the end, if you look at it, Angel Beats sort of did have a happy ending, but had a sad ending as well because of the whole fact of how it went down and where they were stuck. You could say they were stuck in limbo and they couldn't go to heaven where they had to go. And it's just, it's a 13 episode anime. Angel Beats does have its horrible parts, and I will say them right now. It is very rushed. You could see it from like they should have had more time. You feel like it would be like a 25 episode anime, but it feel like it's extremely rushed and to 13 episodes, which is definitely one of its downfalls and not giving enough character development time. But other than those main reasons, this anime's OST is the most beautiful thing I've listened to. It was just amazing. Like, I, I give credit to a lot of animes for its OST because they do it so well. But Angel Beats does it to a certain degree where I just want to listen to music separately. Where I just want to go to a park and nice like waterfall and just listen to the music while closing my eyes and just chilling. You know what I mean? This music is almost like sad type music to listen. It could be wedding music, potential wedding music, funeral music, any kind of music. So. I'll have to give props there, but for, without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, folks, let us start, shall we? And taking number three star is a sad story. Now, PA Works is definitely known for its sad drama stories such as Clan Ad, Air, and Canon. And Angel Beats is definitely not an exception for that. It definitely is sad and depressing in a certain degree. It has happy, obviously enjoyable, funny moments, you know, like filler episodes with the like side characters being all happy and everything else. But then they were just like, it was so sad because at the end, like when it gets to like the end, you get definitely get to see its whole like it's building up. The certain emotion your feeling is building up and everything else. And I think PA Works did a very good job at building that, even though it may seem rushed, but then as some episodes were like needed and some ep more episodes were needed to show you more of how sad it was, but then the, for the 13 episodes, it definitely was depressing and I do like depressing and dark animes and if you do like more like sadder depressing animes, you should definitely consider checking this out just for the sole reason. Now on to the number 2 slot. And taking the number two slot is a very good side characters. I actually prefer the side characters over the main characters because Otonoshi and Yuri just weren't like really feel like main characters. They were either to try to copy each other or try to imitate somebody else. They actually weren't. They don't feel like their own characters, but the side characters are actually unique. Their own personalities. Some are funny, some are strong, some are talented, some like dance, some music, some play baseball, sports, or like ninjas basically. And basically, Ayota, Tamagotsu, Noda, Iri, Yui, every, all the other main characters are just amazing. And whenever they had episodes of them, it was definitely one of my favorite parts of the anime. You get to see Yui, basically the rock star, the, the youngest, and like the whole, the smart one. One, the one, one of the funniest one was like when the guy tried to call him Christ or whatever, and they would not call him that. That was like, he was one of those funny characters, the smart ones also, like when they showed moments with them as well. And basically, Yui is one of my favorite. TK being one of my favorite side characters and characters in general and angel beats and just like how they flesh them out i wish there were more episodes to show character development with them because not all of them got proper screen time and everything else but whenever they did get screen time it was definitely a good time i'll tell you that much and now on to the number one slot and fine, taking that one saw is the most expected thing because I said at the beginning of the video, a beautiful OST, original soundtrack, and basically the theme of SSS, the ending themes, the opening themes are just amazing and beautiful and just well crafted. For sure, I'm not going to like overreact over the music, but this is one of the most beautiful piece of OST I've ever heard and you can just take it anywhere and listen to it and just be at peace and harmony and it is one of the main reasons why you should consider watching Angel Beats, the depressing story and the music and also the amazing side characters that made this anime very worthwhile to watch. Now purchasing the anime, that's a whole nother story, that's up to you if you feel this anime is purchase worthy. I don't feel like it's purchase worthy, I feel like you should stream it 
watch it in subbed if you do so inclined it also has a dubbed if you want to watch it as well i'm not sure how the dub is because i watch my animes on crunchyroll so it's all sub there i don't believe crunchyroll has dubbed animes i'm not 100 percent sure but I, i'm getting off topic right now the music is just it's really good and some of the, the composers i just gotta give them credit oh my lord yui song when they're doing that like the freaking band they had that the girls dead band wherever i can't remember the name of it it's Otonoshi's theme, the SSS theme, the My Soul Your Beats theme, uh, Yui's theme, everyone, uh, Yuri's theme. It's, everyone's was just fantastically well done and one of the best musics I've heard so far. You could tell me I'm overreacting. Maybe I am. This is like 7 a.m. in the morning, so I always say I'm full of energy and overreacting in every single detail. Even though this anime really isn't perfect. Some, but the music is perfect, I'll give it that, even though if the anime does lack in something, it does not lack in the music department. Alright folks, I should basically wrap up my top 3 reasons you should watch Angel Beats. Now if you have not seen Angel Beats, please check out Angel Beats, it's only 13 episodes and hopefully those 3 reasons are the only reasons you need to consider. The amazing OST, just a, a one reason you need, it's just a beautiful soundtrack, my lord, definitely it does it really well. It's not PA Works best anime, I'll give them that. The animation is sloppy compared to some of their anime, sure it's not really the best, but then it's like it's not really the worst in a way. Also, the side characters are beautiful and also the depressing dark story if you're into those kind of animes. So, if you have seen Angel Beach, share this video to your friends who have not seen it because everyone needs to at least give this anime a watch. Definitely stream it. It's definitely sub, dubbed. It doesn't matter what you watch it. And if you want to watch it dubbed and don't want to read subtitles at night, sure, go ahead. If you want to watch it sub and don't mind it, sure, go ahead. I'm not going to judge you on what you watch it anyways. So be sure to leave your top 3 reasons why you would give someone to watch Angel Beats. Please can make your own reasons why you would convince someone to watch Angel Beats. Well, I'm gone.